It's hard to be a footballer, isn't it? Money, fame, fortune, but there's this odd downside too. For every success, there's a rejection. Ever for the very, very best, here are some of the biggest names to be rejected in their careers. Number 10. We have Mario Balotelli, who received a trial in Barcelona back in 2006, but even five goals took him nowhere back then. Marcus Rashford From Manchester City, it was at the age of nine that he got his first brush with football. However, it's the age that played the villain. And Tony Griezmann This guy had it a depressing way as about five clubs rejected him initially due to lack of good height. Diego Costa this poor chap back then lost it thanks to scouting issues and not talent. And it all happened at the age of 15. Roy This chap too lost it all thanks to his age. However, after a while, the seagull failure did not affect him more in the further future. Rude The Dutchman was looking to start his career in England when he was 19 years old. He had trials with Arsenal and Ipswich. Both clubs turned Rude down. However, the forward went on to be one of the most influential players of his generation, playing for huge clubs like AC Milan, PSV and Chelsea, winning two European Cups and multiple league titles. Alan Shearer Alan Shearer, a born and bred Geordie and Newcastle United schoolboy, was turned on by the Mac Peas as a teenager. It's rumoured that Shearer was told that the club were only looking for goalkeeper. So as a boy lad, he attempted to try out in goal and surprisingly failed. Zidane Kenny Dalglish was said to have asked Chairman Jack Walker about making a move for Zidane back when he was still at Bordeaux, to which Walker reported Reportedly replied, Why do you want to sign Zidane when we have Tim Sherwood? The 90s, a simpler time, is so many ways. Number 9. Ronaldo He tried as a teenager to get signed by the favourite club Flamingo, but they turned him down. He joined Cruzeiro instead, hit 44 goals in 47 games for them, moved to PSV, Eden Hoven, at 17 and became the legend he was always destined to be. Mr. Messi, River Plate scouted him, but were also unwilling to invest in the future of the youngster. In the end, it was Barcelona who picked him up and helped him complete his treatment and the rest, as they say, is history. This marks a wrap on today's episode. For more such interesting updates, you better get back to Last Page Reader.